Good morning everyone, how are you all? I'm Zaman Ejus. For this hot happening segment, ASICS has been known as the world's best running shoe. I'm actually wearing a pair of ASICS running shoe myself. And as, as you can see here, I'm here at the Boulevard Hotel to attend the very special ASICS Runners Technical Workshop 2012. And this is conducted by the technical specialist all the way from Singapore. So let's take a look. So here with me is Andy Neo, who is the technical specialist of ASICS from Singapore. How are you, Andy? I'm fine, great. Great to be honoured to be invited here to do the presentations. Oh, it's our pleasure to meet you. So tell us about this uh, technical workshop, runner, uh, ASICS Runners Technical Workshop that we have here today. Okay, basically, right, this uh, workshop, we're going to focus on, uh, first of all, it's very systematic. First of all, we're talk about the history of ASICS. The idea, the philosophy of ASICS, how we design shoes. And after that, we'll talk about a little bit on uh, foot biomechanics. Because since we are a very technical brand, we have to understand how your foot moves in such a way. And because if you understand how your foot moves, right, it's very easy for you to find a shoe that match your foot motion because everybody, the way we land, are pretty different, it's very subjective. So, so shoes matching is very important as well. So you, uh, this workshop, you learn about shoe matching as well, how to match uh, right shoes. Even if you have the most expensive shoe, but if the shoe don't match your foot motions, it's, gonna be, it's not going to be the right way. So you have to understand how your foot moves and how to match the right shoe to your own foot. Uh, it's very important because um, sometimes runners, they don't really understand how your, what's the over what's the under right? It's very, the word is being, you know, being loosely used. So it's very subjective, all right? So you're always good to, to if you doesn't know anything, it's always good to find a, a physiotherapist, someone to analyze for you, whether are you, you're not. Okay, basically for someone who over you can actually, if you do not have, if you have, oh, sorry, if you have your own running shoes, right? You can actually put your shoes on the flat tables, alright. So for instance, this is the pair of shoes. Someone who overprint it, right? By playing the shoes, right? The shoes actually t tend to roll, is, yeah, tend to tilt to, to inside, alright. So because the way you run, you something called pronation. Basically, your foot will hit the ground and start to roll in. This is pronation. Pronation is very important. Everybody needs to pronate because it's actually a damping effect, help to absorb shock. But when you roll in, some people roll in more than what's required. That's basically over pronations. So that's why the shoe tend to tilt in more because the wear and tear is usually on the inside. So this one way you can uh, analyze whether are you over pronated or not. So vice versa, if you are the under the shoe actually tilt outwards instead. Yeah. So if you over print, you need to get shoe something a little bit stiff on the inside, on the arch area to prevent your uh, yeah, support your arch so the arch don't collapse in too much. So if you under print it, that means your your foot is very your bones, your midfoot bones are very stiff, you cannot roll in. You take away the heart, the, the stiff area here, you make it soft on the inside, so your ankle it encourage your ankle to roll in. So that's the difference between a cushioning shoe versus a structured cushioning shoe, or some people refer to them as stability shoes. The objective of this workshop is because some runners come in already know uh, they like to relate arch type to your foot motions, which I think is good. But then it's a very um, it's too hasty to to relate your foot motion with arch because you neglect areas like your forefoot of, of your foot. Just remember in this workshop we talk about modern food, the effect of modern food, the effect of bunions. Right, all these are very important as well, important areas when you look at examining your own foot as well. So your own existing running shoe is actually the best physical evidence of your foot motion. So arch type is good, but it's not uh, exhaustive enough. So, so you have to look in a more holistic approach. Yeah. So basically here, right, in this, you, uh, the, this workshop is to give you more informations. Just rely, apart from just relying on the arch type, you have more added informations. And we will learn about buying a pair of uh, proper running shoes. Wow, so these are the latest collection from ASICS and it's really uh, tailored for those who with a high arch, neutral as well as mild flat and they come in lots of colours as well as sizes for men as well as for women. So for more information, you can log on to their Facebook which is facebook.com slash ASICS Malaysia. I'm Zamalija signing off, see you again. Never